Howdy, hey, this is Frackbox, and I'm here with Omega Wolf. Hi. So we're just continuing uh, Halo oh, 3. Wait. Or Halo, not Halo 3, what am I talking about? I Okay, so I almost messed up. I was... <laughs> I almost said Half-Life, <laughs> and then I needed to correct myself, so I said Halo 3, but for some reason my mind was like, Half-Life 3. <laughs> so, like I said, I said the correct thing, Halo, and then 3. That That's the thinking that went on in my mind, but um, you got a headshot with the assault the rifle somehow. Yep. Oh my gosh, his vitals are fading. Oh, uh, no, I'm backing up. So we're basically going to save Commander Keys. Or Cap Captain. Oh my gosh, Cap <laughs> Captain Keys. I keep demoting him. Um, <laughs> but like... Wow, I'm surprised Going back to the dead horse. Back to the dead horse we were beating in the last uh, episode. At least he held out. <gasps> no! <laughs> <laughs> you just, I, just, <laughs> I, I'm actually really surprised there's still elites alive. Yeah, that's really surprising. But it's it's. Anyway, oh, well, there goes his knee. What you, what the, the captain about? should be commended for how long he did hold out. Yeah. against the proto grave mine. Oh, totally. It's very impressive. Very very impressive. Nope. And in the words of of another, that's uh, it's truly outrageous. Truly yeah. truly truly outrageous. Wait, what? <laughs> Who? <laughs> you know, the gems. They're truly outrageous. Truly, truly. Outrageous. I think I have I made a point to not watch that. I didn't watch it either. Um, Let's see. I don't know much about it. And yet I just know they made like a they made a, a new like live action film, which I heard really sucked. Like a lot. I don't know. It's just whatever. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Ugh. Might want to back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Anyway, uh, let's see here. How close are we to the to the end of the mission? Because you basically you get to Captain Keys, and Whoa. then you just do you have any grenades? Uh, plasma yeah. grenades. Good enough. Oh my gosh, this is wow. I think in the book the chief was backpedaling with a lot of the flood. As really? Well. Yeah. Ow! Excuse me. Well, he is. That's rude. Most certainly dead. That's just rude. Oh, there's the captain. Um. <laughs> oh, okay. dang it! I was gonna check to see if there was any ammo. It's cutscene time. That's kind of gross. Yes. They uh, made it more disgusting. No human life signs detected. The captain. It reminds me of that weird oh monster in Doctor Who that just absorbed people and like put hit their faces you know on his body. That's really disturbing. Yeah. What he'd want us to do. Do it. That's gross. Yeah, I, I mean, I wouldn't stick that in my head. <laughs> well, I don't think the grave mind would have had time to to rewrite it or anything, but. Um, uh, oh boy, there's gonna oh, be this, this is... fuel rods. <gasps> ah! Oh my gosh! You give me that! Oh! Wow, okay, this one you might you might die a lot. Yeah, I didn't have the shotgun. I need that health. <laughs> but no, I mean, he's definitively dead, so there's, yeah. there's no reason to, like, not take the thing that was in his head. See here, come on. That was like his implant, basically. Yeah, yeah. His, his neural implant. Every UNSC has one. Was the express? So obviously, the reason we came here was to rescue him. But in the event that he died, what was the main reason for taking the implant? It has the codes in order to activate the the self destruct on the halo on, on pillar of autumn. On the pillar of autumn. Okay. Oh, okay, that makes sense. That makes yeah. total sense. Okay. I'm not sure if that's strictly for every captain and commander, but... Yeah. Let's see here. Pick it up! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Chief. Okay, so basically no, we're that's just worse. escaping. 
Oh, right. This is the mission before the last mission, yeah. isn't it? So basically, when we escape, we're going to take a, a Banshee. Yes, is we're going right? to hijack a Banshee. And it's one of the Banshees that are the... Is it just the regular Banshees, or is it the spacefaring yeah. Banshees? Uh, I'm... Oh, <gasps> or does that matter? Uh, no. uh, it's super surprising that these guys are still alive. These are commando units. Well, I guess that makes sense that they're still alive then. Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh Do you need to go down there? <laughs> <laughs> just, 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 it's time to end it all. <laughs> oh, you're all the way back here. Alright. Uh... Uh, yeah, they're not gonna go there. Oh, look at all those shiny metals. Yeah, I'm still not going anywhere near that. Hopefully, we can. Please. Yeah, just, just let them. Yeah, because basically, what you want to well, let them do is fight each other, and then just get away up, and just pick up the scraps. Wow, whoa, Aggie! Oh my gosh, you have like whoa! No, what the? No, no ammo. you are too close. Oh, good. More ammo. Let's see here. Where where was the shotgun? Where was the shotgun? Aliens, give me a shotgun. <laughs> All right. It's it's actually surprising that the the Covenant don't have like a shotgun equivalent. Yeah, I was actually. I think I've thought about that before. Let's see here. Because it'd be useful for like because they have room clearing. Like they do SWAT type stuff, right? Uh, they try to capture human ships. So it would make sense to have, like, a shotgun at some point. Yeah. I mean, that whole class of weapon just doesn't exist for them, which is super weird. Yeah, well... But it'd be a lot, it'd be a lot easier to make a, a shotgun plasma weapon than it would be to make, like, this. It would be easier to make a flamethrower. Yeah, I guess that's true. Because that's... <gasps> you are gonna die. No. <laughs> not this time. Man, I'm just... Ugh. What is going on with my gameplay? Yeah, seriously. I think it's just you've been playing for a while, so. No, 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 not you. You don't get to live. Ooh. Let's see here. I remember always just jumping down. Not, probably. not you, that you, far. You, you probably want to like take baby steps as far as your jumps down. Oh, what? Uh, you know, I wonder. Can uh, I? <laughs> yeah. Yeah! Take that! Oh, good. That was lucky. Oh, this is this is the end of the mission. Yep. If I can survive... Come oh, on, shields. Come on, shields. shields. Back up. I like in Halo 2 how they made your shields operate better. Does it matter which Banshee you take? No. Oh my <laughs> gosh, that thing almost hit you. <laughs> oh my Freedom! Gosh. Oh my gosh. Alright. Also, they have really inefficient... In placed weapons. Like those yeah. plasma things. Like at least with bullets, it's just gonna you know, it's gonna <laughs> it's gonna go really fast for for long distance engagements. Yeah. Basically the the Covenant have two different engagements that they're really good at. Medium range engagements and like basically hose you down. Uh, or, or, like medium range engagements for their plasma weapons. And yeah. then they have like ship to ship based combat. And yeah. that's the only two that's the only two ranges that they're good at. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe like close uh, distance because they're super strong, you know, the elites. Yeah. And brutes. But they're missing like the long range. And then they're like there's from like long range and then you need to go. Or to, like, at least ship this range. fleet yeah, is missing it. This fleet anyway. Because um, they, they got long range with the beam rifle. And also the, the Covenant Carbine. But the beam rifle is actually not plasma. It's like a particle. Right. I guess they did fix that in Halo 2. So they do have long range. So Anyway, let's go ahead and call this episode here since we're done. Yeah. <laughs> and um, this is for Ackbox. This is Meg Wolf. Have a great day. Stay safe.